Anye kele munu. E ham bijo ma confidence. Abu mwa adane mi yo nyonyo na YouTube. Asin kan kele nu no lo dubai maka gene ni bo language janaga aga aya aga anaga anaga wa sha wa. Ana ma si yo nyene me ya gari ya ke woke ne me gari ya ma ke wanyi ne me ya gari ya. Oji kobe yene je gule mo la konu kum kwa fule na zi. Ekbe beru go beru mo ye sene nke ye begu. Unku kwa ana. Ia ina ekperu chuku bugunu. Ko garo nyo abu na gara woke gara wanyi. Ok? So my wonderful people, I welcome you back again to my YouTube channel. If today is your first time seeing my beautiful face, you are highly welcome. I am Confidence, a mommy vlogger based here in Abuja, Nigeria. Please, for my old subscribers, you guys are amazing. And I really appreciate you all for all your efforts towards my channel. Okay? So, in today's video, I really don't want to, you know, waste much of your time. Because it's, it's, it's as if it's highly requested from those of you that is actually watching my video. Okay? So, and I actually promise a lot of you guys that I'm going to be making this video today. Okay? So, in today's video, is about witches and witch the witchcraft behind ourselves uh spiritual stealers spiritual thieves and um it, when maybe your your market is not moving fine so we are actually going to be solving that problem today okay so in today's video all we need is this particular two things so but before we before i show you what we are going to be needing in this particular video i really want to uh, tell you guys what is all about okay if you are having problem in yourself like you are not your, your business is not moving actually you will go to the shop your own individual shop you will stay there from morning to night nobody will come inside that shop to ask you if you are there to sell this video is for you please take a seat and relax and watch this video okay and if you are not making any progress and if you are encountering uh, um, all sorts of witches, witchcrafts, you, you, even in your shop, you do hear them crying like oh, as if the, a small baby is crying. This video is for you. Please realize and enjoy this video, okay? And uh, I, I actually want you to know that if you if you really want to do this thing, you have to, you know be bold enough it's not something that is not harmful it's just something to protect yourself protect your business protect your life protect your protect everything that concerns you actually so what you are going to be doing with what we are going to be doing with this video is two cocoa yam if you have more than two cocoa yam you can use it for this video but i just want to as an example i just want to use these two cocoa yam i don't know but a lot of you some of you that is Nigeria, we know this. We normally use this thing to cook soup, more especially when you are cooking bitter leaf soup, or maybe you are cooking oha soup. You can use this cocoa yam. This cocoa yam is not the type that you can just boil and start eating it. Okay, it's just for the thickness of the soup. So I don't know if you can see it very well. So if you want to make this, make this video. If you want to make a. Uh, uh, if you want to make use of uh, this cocoa yam, you have to get this type of cocoa yam. It's not the type that you can just because sometimes it bites. You understand? Uh, if even if you want to eat this type, you have to cook it for a long time for it to done very well before you start eating it. It's not the type that you just boil and start eating it. Okay? So this is very very spiritual. It pursues the witchcraft. It both sells in the shop. Assuming now for your shop, for example, now for your shop, what you are going to be doing for your shop is, so you are going to also be making use of broom. This broom, eh? If you know the 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 spiritual benefit of broom, if you have not watched that video on my previous video, please try and watch it. This broom is very very powerful. Witchcraft doesn't doesn't like brooms, so that's why you are going to make use of this broom together with this cocoa yam. Okay, so what you are going to be doing, you are going to be uh, putting it inside the broom like this. I just have to quickly show you guys example on how you are going to do it. You are going to put it inside this uh, broom like this. You see how it looks like. I still have to put it inside more for you to know what I am talking about. For you to see how it is. Okay, you can see how it looks now. So, you are going to be putting, if you have many... 
you are going to be putting many of it inside uh, this broom. Then what you are going to be doing, you are going to put it inside your shop where no eyes is going to see it. Nobody will see where you kept it, where you are going to keep it, rather. So you are going to put it inside your shop and nobody is going to see it. Do you know what is going to do in your shop? Any bad influence, any bad energy that is coming into that your shop, this thing will pursue, pursue that person away. Any witches and witch, any witches and wizard coming inside your shop to steal from you, this thing is going to pursue it away. Any witches and wizard that is not making your your sense to boost fast, this thing will pursue it, pursue it, and you will you will notice that your your increase of sense, you, you will notice the increase of sense in your shop. You will notice the increase of sense in your business. And I know, I believe, I strongly believe that you are going to come back to give me your testimony. It boasts says a lot and it pursues any bad energy, any bad eye, any bad thing coming into your shop. Even people planning to steal from you. This thing will actually destroy all their plans and they will start, they will just forget about your shop entirely. And you'll be wondering why and how. You start making progress in your shop, believe me. So, coming to your house. Secondly, coming to your house. If you, uh, if you, if you, if you are the type that don't always sleep in the night, things, many, many things that you don't even know about. You can't even, you can't even explain how they used to come into your house, like disturbing you from sleeping. You do hear voice, you know, all this, all this spiritual attack. In your house maybe probably in your room okay this is what you are going to do you are also going to do this thing in your room yes you are also going to keep it whether in your parlor in your sitting room or in your room anywhere that you used to contact this particular thing you are going to put this thing inside that place okay you can put it where eyes can see it because that is your house it is only in the shop that you will just hide it so that people will not see it okay so that even if they have any bad mind coming into that your shop this thing will pursue it away it has a strong power okay it has a strong power and it boasts very well okay so in your house you are going to put it on top of your bed like you can just use a um, nail to to put on the wall then after after putting after putting the the cocoyam inside this inside this broom you can as well do it like this or you look for something to tie it okay i can as well put the second one for you to know but it's i don't even know if it is necessary let me just use this one as an example for you guys to understand so you just do it like this use rubber band or anything to tie it then you hang it on the wall inside your room okay where you sleep and believe me you are going to sleep peacefully you're going to sleep like a baby and wake up like a lion. Nothing is going to happen. You will not even encounter anything. You will sleep and wake up healthy. Believe me. And for your business, it boasts a lot. And it pursues witches and witchcraft. Honestly. And anything that is blocking your way, it really pursues them a lot. So I will gladly, I will gladly like if you do this thing or you practice it at home okay and you come back and give me your testimony if you have anything if you have any question concerning this video let me know under the comment section i'll be glad to answer all your questions okay and believe me i will see you in my next video but please consider subscribing if you have not done so if you have not subscribed to my youtube channel please consider subscribing and if you have not if you have not liked this video up to this point please i beg you in the name of god please consider liking this video give it a thumbs up let's grow together okay and i will see you in my next video ciao stay blessed bye bye thank you guys